Hey everyone, I'm Jason. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your IVMS 4500 app. So Hike Vision recently shut down their IVMS 4500 uh, updates on the app and the actual program that allows you to see it. Okay, so let's head over to the recorder. Okay, so we're here at the recorder. I'm gonna go to menu, configurations, network. So guys, if you have access platform or cloud P2P here, right next to general, please check out the video that's in the description because that will fix your issue. For those who do not have this option right here no worries what you're going to do is we're going to go back to ddns we're going to check mark it now you're going to look for no ip you're going to click on it so now let's head over back to the computer okay so what you guys are going to do is you're going to go to your search bar you're going to type in no ip.com it'll bring you here so you're going to do is we're going to set up it's a free account it will, will not cost you anything so we're just going to do sign up. So you can enter your email, your password, and a host name. So the host name is what we're going to need. Do this right now really quickly. So over here, you're going to type it in. Once again, you could pick which one you want. I'm just going to use this one. And then what you're going to do is over here you have to agree if you want to get some uh, news and some special offers just check mark it I'm gonna uncheck it and I'm gonna do free sign up okay so I just confirmed my email so as you can see your account is now active okay so from here we're gonna to go to my account Uh, it's asking to complete your account configuration. Um, you have to add a security con You can continue doing this. I'm just gonna hit cancel for now. So right here on the top, one activate, and here's your, right here, here is my, um, my DNS I just created. So double check it, make sure you guys spelt everything correctly. So now let's head over back to the recorder. Okay, so we're back at the recorder. So let's go back to network. Once again, this is for the recorders that does not have this option. So we'll go to DDNS, check mark that. Now over here, we're gonna go to no IP. Over here, we're gonna type in the following. This is the website from the no IP. Now it's the domain that you created. Over here, the, the username and the password is the actual website username and password that you created at the beginning. So email address, then the password. Now the password. Okay, so once you type everything in, hit apply. And where it says DNS is not enabled, we're gonna wait for that to change. Okay, if it takes a while, what we're gonna do is exit out of here. We're gonna go to reboot. Give it a few seconds for the system to reboot. So there you guys have it. And uh, there you go, after a reboot, the status of the DNS is normal. So now the system is all done. So now if we go back to the IVMS 4500 app, 
I'm going to show you how to make some changes to that one too now. Okay, so we open up the app, hit the little plus button on the top, and we're going to do the first option, manual adding. Once again, top, doesn't really matter. Name it whatever you like. Over here, where it says Height Connect Domain, we're going to click on it. So you had before the HIDDNS, which now it's going to be changed. So now you're going to go to IP forward slash domain. And that's the address that you created in the no IP. So now the username and password is the username and password of your recorder. Default admin is usually the username and the password is the password of your recorder. So once you do that, just hit save, top corner, then you could do start live view. I don't have any cameras here, so it's not going to should display anything, but that's uh, how simple it is to do it. So guys, if you have any questions, please give me a comment below. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Please hit that subscribe button. And once again, thanks for watching.